hi everyone welcome to a new video today we're going to show you the petrol pump for fiat strada fiat palio right and uh, it, it can go to you can use it can be used by a couple of uh series of what those fiat stuff so this is the one for fiat strada so we took it out and uh, it was not working so then we replaced it with a new one which is this the fuel pump itself is not the pump you know uh, this is not the pump but it's the complete it's a complete what uh, device so but the pump is in inside here I think you can see this is the pump which I'm touching now this is the pump so this pump it goes into this housing so what happened we change the pump so the reason why I'm gonna show you I'm doing this video is when you want to change the pump on a fiat strata don't go down on the on the tank and uh, unscrew it here's the tank and uh, that's the tank you unscrew it and put it down it's not a good idea so we discovered that it caused a, a major issue whereby when we dropped the tank uh, this part got broken you can see this part got broken so this part when it got broken it has to look like this so when it got broken we tried to bypass it we bypass it and then it started leaking oil you get me so we tried 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 all whatever we tried all our efforts we went in uh, just for for free so what we did now we went and bought and buy a this housing it's difficult to get it right i got to you can go to marketplace whichever country where you are you can get that because a new one maybe if you you stay in europe maybe italy where these cars come from you might get it even here in south africa you can get them but the new one is extremely expensive what we've seen in this country a fiat car is a good car but it doesn't have a resale value so once you buy that car to resell it's the problem so and uh, what is the problem the problem is these guys they don't make it easier for you to get parts so the parts we get we get them from used cars because the new ones we can afford them so they can tell you this can cost you over i would say 500 400 300 us dollars only this so sometimes what people do uh, they, they don't buy the entire device unless if it's damaged like this so ours is uh, it was what damaged this was damaged but before it wasn't damaged we bought this pump this pump is a universal what pump is not the original pump the one we put in here so we put it in it was working 100 percent still new but then we find a challenge whereby we break this so after breaking this so we had to go and buy another part so when we bought another part from a different car which is fiat palio and it was um used so the guy gave us the entire unit so what happened is like it had also a fuel pump which is uh which was old so we said instead of replacing this with that one because this is new we said let's leave it like that so we tested it worked so now i want to go to another part so what you have to do you have to unscrew your fiat uh, strata these screws all of them you take them out going this side you take them out going that side so you take out this plastic you can see this plastic once you take it out you slide it you can see like this so now we've already done so we're gonna you what you're gonna do you're gonna slide it out so the tank is here you get me so there is also uh so this thing is the first thing you're gonna see it's gonna have a cap on it so these are screws these places are screws you're gonna take out all uh one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen you're gonna take out 13 screws then you take it out once you take it out if this is not damaged then what you're gonna do you're gonna have to clip this off then you take out your pump right so this housing also goes out then you connect the pump then you are done so once you're done so one thing i wanted to show on the pump also uh you might find this one will find like uh, this part fell off 
so it was in the tank inside so it could not mm, do the gauge the gauging uh, the gauging system was not working well so uh, what it cause it sits in like this so once the petrol is low uh, when it's up it makes this to float get me floats floats and floats so when it floats to this stage then it will say that petrol is full so this is the device which what which me measures those two things you understand so uh, I think you can see this uh, okay this is where it moves it moves from here to up here so then what I want to say is if you don't have or if you don't get this part you have to use what they call marketplace and you get a used part because new parts in South Africa they are very very difficult to get for Fiat not difficult to get but they are expensive so Fiat uses the agents to to sell those parts and you know they put a markup they put a lot of uh, money on top of that sometimes you find there's no uh, there's no what there's no part what they do they order it in Italy so that is a, a stress so which means you're gonna pay more in that so first and uh, foremost what we recommend you don't drop your tank because you're gonna damage this one this, uh, this pump it's a very easy process to do uh, this pump housing you're gonna damage it so once you damage it you're gonna be in stress because all the bypasses might not work you must be very good to bypass this so we were lucky that we got a new part another part which we replaced fiat strada fiat uh, palio and uh, other kind of fiat so what you have to do is to take out that go with it maybe in your in the scrapyard you're gonna then find the same part then you replace it so but the pump when you go to the spare parts if this is not damaged the pump they won't sell to you you can buy in a, a, a universal one because it also they say it also goes to bmw and other cars so there are companies which do or manufacture those pumps you get so in another video i showed you how to test it if the pump is working you get me so if the pump is working um you only have to it has two wires here uh you can see the you put your two wires there then you put on a battery for let me show you what you can do you you get two wires you get two wires you put them here not here you put them here inside positive and negative so you put on also on your battery positive and negative it will start moving it's a boom it's a motor inside it's the one which pumps the petrol but if it's still connected to the petrol thing what you can do is uh, when you connect it it's gonna start spitting out some petrol so that's when you're gonna see that oh my well, my fuel pump is working so this is the fuel pump this is the housing for fuel pump so the entire unit it works together to help you or to make the fuel pump system so the most difficult thing to get is this when it's damaged but the fuel pump itself is easier because there is a universal one so that's not a stress so most people even they said don't buy fiat but to me i've been driving a fiat i have two fiat so I believe it's a very good, good car, but it needs when you are willing to suffer with the pain of spare parts. You get me? So there are many, many things we have to do on this car. So that simply means we have to spend a lot of money on this car anyway. But because you love the car, you want to keep it, you don't mind spending a lot of money. So that was the video, guys. I tried to explain our fuel pump the fuel pump housing and the, the fuel pump system and also what you do in this video what you're gonna understand that even if you don't buy uh the fuel pump housing for fiat strata you can get the one for fiat padio so they use the same spare parts some of the spare parts are the same that's a good thing anyway 
so if you find a person who understands fiat then he's gonna help you get that to work thanks for watching guys and see you in the next video